Hi guys, today we're going to talk about money and we've done this before in class so you should be experts now. Now remember money is very important because we use it every day in our lives and we have to know different amounts of money and how to work out change and when we go to buy things so we don't lose any money. <laughs> so we have a one pence, two pence, five pence, ten pence, twenty pence, fifty pence, one pound, two pound, then we have a £5 note, £10 note, £20 note, £50 note. There are different ways to make different amounts of money. So for example, if I said to you, can you show me how you would make £5? I'm going to show you my example. Now I know some of you would have done the same, a five pound note, but is that the only way we can show five pounds? How else could we make five pounds? There you go, there's another way to make five pounds. Two pound, one pound, one pound, one pound, so two, three, four, five, five pounds. I want you to show me how you would make one pound. How can you make one pound? I've got a one pound coin to make one pound, I've got two 50p coins to make one pound, and I've got 20p, 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 so five 20p's to make one pound, okay? So I know there's loads of other ways. What other ways did you figure out? Now, what we're going to do is solve a word problem together, okay? So we're going to read the question carefully. A sandwich which costs three pounds and a drink which costs two pounds. What is the total cost of both items? Now, how would you work the answer out to this question? Right, fantastic. So, for our bar, we've got a whole bar here. Now, how many parts of this bar should there be? How many items do we have? Fantastic. Now, this one's three pound and this one's two pound. So, which piece of the bar would be bigger? This one or this one? Well done, the three pound. So, if I divide it around there, this part of the bar would be how much? Fantastic. This part of the bar would be two pounds. The calculation is asking me to take away or add. What is the total cost of both items? So what word tells me if I need to add or subtract? Well done, that means we have to add them together. 3 plus 2 equals 5. How much did I spend on the food? Well done, it is 5 pounds. Right, so here's your answer guys. So I've got one part of the bar is £1.50 and £2. You add them together and you get £3.50. What you could have also done is drawn out the coins and counted the coins and added them together. So as a challenge now if you want, can you, how many different ways can you make £3.50? Right, before I go guys, I've got a maths joke for you. Joke for you. Why was the maths book really sad? It said it had too many problems. Ha 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 ha!